What's good guys, it's Sam here. Today's uh, Friday, uh, February 10th maybe or something, or 9th, and, um, or 8th I think, and uh, I took today off from the gym. I don't want to talk about that. <clears throat> but if this is your first time here, make sure you press that subscribe button and that bell notification so YouTube can tell you every time I post a video. Um, so yesterday marked 12 days in a row of overtraining, uh, no breaks, uh, don't, now I'm not saying anybody else should do this, I'm just saying this was my experiment and I wanted to try it. Um, so, uh, 12 days in a row, um, I think of those 12 days, 10 of them were doubles, meaning I worked out in the morning and in the evening, and the purpose of it was, I just wanted to lose a little bit more fat before I go on vacation later this coming week to Costa Rica. So uh, I was like, what's a really quick way I can burn off some extra fat? So I decided to try it. And the amount of fat that I dropped over that 12 days was just crazy. Um, I don't weigh myself, or I haven't weighed myself, I should say, in since maybe October. So it's been quite a long time since I've actually weighed myself. I would guess I'm probably around 230 pounds, but honestly, I don't know. I could be around 215, I could be around 240. I, I, I don't know exactly, um, because I haven't weighed myself, but what I do know is that the amount of fat lost in my midsection, my legs, my chest, um, a little bit in my back, uh, the, the most amount of fat that I saw drop was in my midsection and it was just completely completely tremendous the amount of fat that I saw drop in my uh, obliques and um, just in my abs in general uh, the amount of fat was just crazy if you go back and look at some of the posing videos from two weeks ago ish two two and a half weeks ago versus the one I posted yesterday the you you'll be able to see the tremendous amount of difference the diet stayed about the same I cut calories just a little bit um, but the reason that I decided to stop um, yesterday was because I felt that I was getting potentially I was wearing down on my immune system and my CNS uh, or central nervous system central nervous system and I thought it would probably not be a good idea to get sick right before vacation so I decided to take today off today's Friday um, <clears throat> So uh, I took today off, uh, not doing any cardio, not gonna do any, um, any workouts at all. And um, my knees have been feeling a little funky from the cardio. Not that I'm doing anything intense, I'm generally just walking or walking at like a brisk pace on the Stairmaster or the treadmill. But my knees were starting to bother me a little bit. So I figured give them a break, maybe two days in a row, like take today off and tomorrow potentially, uh, and just see how they feel, or maybe let just let my body recover completely. Uh, um, from a joint standpoint, the, oh, I didn't notice anything really. My my chest and my upper pecs, because uh, that's a generally I'll, I'll focus a lot on my when I'm doing chest. I'll generally start with a um, upper chest movement. Um, say like an incline fly or an incline press or I'll do a flat and then I'll do two or three incline movements so my upper pecs were very tight I started doing some more foam rolling over the last three or four days on my upper chest and my shoulders but I once I started feeling the nasally uh, not I wasn't super congested but I could just I almost felt that I was like, oh, hey, if you keep doing this, you can push yourself over that brink of where then you become sick and then you're just gonna hurt yourself from the fat loss standpoint. Um, so I decided that today is gonna be the last day. I did not work out this morning. I'm not gonna work out tonight. Um, my diet is going to be about the same. I might carb up slightly. Um, depends on how I feel tomorrow. I might do a note of workout tomorrow or I might just take two days off in a row and see how I feel for Sunday so that I can start this coming week really strong. Uh, or just go do in there and just do some stretching and foam rolling or something like that. But I wanted to give you guys an update. Hope you guys create an epic fucking weekend. It is Massachusetts, which means it's raining. 
I feel like Massachusetts, this is the first time I've lived in Massachusetts. Uh, it is, uh, I feel like this is how uh, Seattle is, where it rains every fucking day. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. Uh, come say what's up on Instagram or if you have any questions. Uh, today I did decide to take um, some modafinil. I took uh, 50 milligrams of modafinil. So if you want to check out some of the videos I have on that, go, go to the channel and uh, look up Modafinil. And I have some videos on that. I will probably do another update later today. Hope you guys have an awesome weekend. I'll talk to you soon.